Hey there, I'm Tesla and in this Unreal Engine 4 tutorial we're going to look at how we can draw text in game. So to do this we're going to be looking at HUD blueprints, adding some functionality to them and also looking at blueprint interfaces. So let's jump right in. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is make sure you have a game mode. So you come to blueprints and you can create a game mode but I'm using a realistic rendering so I already have a game mode. And now we need to create a HUD blueprint. So we'll come to HUD, create. I'm just going to name this my HUD. Now, to simply draw text in game, we'll begin by right clicking, add event, event receive draw HUD, and right click again, draw text. And we can connect these up. So, event receive draw HUD is just enabling the HUD events and it's just constantly firing. So, this text is always going to be on our screen, but I'll show you how we can set it up so we can turn text on and off. But for right now, we'll just stick with this. Um, we can add some text. I'm just going to put in what are you doing. And now we can choose our font. However, we don't have any fonts. So I'll show you how we can create fonts. We'll right click in the content browser, come to materials and textures, and come to font. And you see we have our default font browser. So we can choose any fonts. I'm just going to choose this one. And we can choose our size. Now, the size, I believe, should always be the highest size. Or the bigger size, a bit larger size, sorry. And I'm going to choose 72. The reason being, if we choose a lower one and decide we want to scale it up in game, it's just going to lose the quality. So bigger is better. And I'm just going to name this my font. And now we can choose the font. Okay, so we'll click compile and jump in game. However, there's a problem the text doesn't draw straight away. And the reason being is I don't have any idea but we'll change the text color we'll click play and now it will work okay so we simply have some text in game but let's make it so we come to close to the balcony and the text appears but we move away and the text disappears so to do that we need to create a blueprint interface we'll right click come to miscellaneous and select blueprint interface and let's just name this show text. So a blueprint interface is basically a function that can be com uh, that can communicate between all these different bl blueprints. So we'll come into the, the interface, add a function. Let's name this show text and as an input we're going to leave it as a ball so we can tick and untick it and we're going to name this show text question mark and you'll see why in just a second open up the level blueprint right click and you can see we have interface messages now and you see we have our show text and you can see we can check and uncheck our ball so if we create a box trigger and scale it up We can right click, add event, collision, begin overlap, and connect it up. So when we enter the box trigger, we can check show text. So this is true. So let's make it false when we exit the bo box trigger. So we'll add event, collision, end overlap. We can just copy and paste this, uncheck it, connect it up, and then we can click compile however we get an error and the reason being is we don't have a target now the target is going to be our HUD blueprint so to do this we'll right click and we're going to type in get player controller select that just drag this out and type in get HUD and it's as simple as that now there's one last thing we need to do and it's just adding some more functionality to our HUD blueprint so we'll drag this out We'll type in gate and we've got a gate here so the reason being is we want to open the gate and close the gate with the condition of the box trigger sorry with the condition of the show text interface so we'll right click and we're going to grab a branch so true will be connected to open and false will be connected to close and to call our interface we need to add it in the blueprint props so we'll come up here 
select blueprint props scroll down to interfaces select add and you can see we have our interface and now we can add an event for our interface you see we find event show text and we can connect these up but we can also connect up the uh, conditions and that's all we need to do so I'm just change the scale of this and uh, we can change the color as well okay so it's appearing and disappearing when we enter the box trigger okay guys well I hope you enjoyed this tutorial it's just been a really basic introduction to drawing text with the HUD blueprint Make sure you stay subscribed for any future tutorials and thanks for checking it out. Cheers!